I'm Nick Kanan. I'm an assistant professor of translational science and molecular medicine at Michigan State University College of Human Medicine. Our main focus is on Alzheimer's disease and other dementias, and even more specifically, there's a category of diseases called tauopathies, um, and they're called that because they involve the pathological accumulation of a protein that's called tau. This is normally a, a protein that's found in your brain, but in the disease process, it is changed in ways that ruin its ability to do what it normally does. As a scientist, you think about, okay, how can this experiment that I'm going to do or this hypothesis I'm testing ultimately make its way into the clinic and help the people? And that's really what kind of drives the, the research. One of the things that attracted me to MSU and to the group that I work with is our team-based philosophy on science. There's numerous ways you can approach studying a disease and one person can't know all of them or do all of them and so it's really building a team that can approach this problem in a multifaceted way. I think that includes researchers like me, it includes the institutions that we work at like MSU, it includes federal funding agencies like the National Institute of Health or NIH and very importantly it includes private funding sources and it's when all of those team members kind of come together that you can really make strides towards uh, significant progress and, and really making advances that matter. People ask me all the time if we make discoveries, like what's the greatest new discovery you've, you've made and I, I mean in a very real way you kind of make discoveries every day. They might not be the big, you know, cure, big, you know, eureka discoveries, but literally every day you make small discoveries and you say, okay, well, that's what that did. Okay, let's see if it does something else if we modify it this way. I think ultimately for people to be in this kind of profession, they have to care about helping people. And when you get those discoveries, you, what you're doing is you're adding new knowledge that's helping us move closer to helping people. It feels good to contribute to society and, and medicine and people and making them live, helping them live a better life. I mean, that feels really good.